Reports. After question marks around the WFISD for weeks now, it now appears the school board is ready to move forward with some answers. That's thanks in part to longtime WFISD educator and now acting superintendent Debbie Dipri, who delivered her first superintendent report during the school board special session today. Dipri says the most important thing at any campus throughout the WFISD will be to put student needs first, adding that no decision for the district will be made without first thinking of how it will affect students and teachers. As a self-described product of Wichita Falls, having graduated from the WFISD and Midwestern State, moving into this role could not mean more to Dipri. Those two entities have made a huge difference in my personal life, that of my, my husband, my sons. Um, anything that I can do going forward that can, can assist or support the activities and the needs of, of Wichita Falls ISD, and the community at large, I'm honored to do. And some decisions may have to be made in the next few months with independent consultant Gary Patterson. Now a week into diving into the WFISD's finances, Dipri says the financial review is vital to the district's future so they know where they stand to make informed decisions. The school board also heard updates on construction of the two new high schools. David Potter with BYSP Architects says you should expect to see a lot of dirt at the work sites for the next few months. Meanwhile, they've been able to make some decisions like interior selections for things like carpet colors, walls, and tile. Potter also informed the school board that the full plans for both auditoriums have been greenlit, something that was up in the air previously due to funds, but is no longer a problem for the district. 